Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to talk about autism and meltdowns and what happens to me today this topic was brought up to me in a hospital meeting and basically I was asked how a meltdown affects me as a autistic female and I know a lot of meltdowns are different for a lot of people on the autism spectrum so I'm going to talk about from my own perspective very very briefly from what I've experienced and yeah so autism and meltdowns what happens to me so everything becomes overwhelming it see it's like a red mist appears I just lose focus concentration ability to focus everything just becomes overwhelmed my emotions all become blurred into one emotion so sadness anger frustration all becomes blurred and mixed up I'm, I'm unable to separate anything at that point and then it's like somebody is trying to stretch my head. So it's like I have somebody trying to pull me like this. And it's like I'm being squeezed on my head, my face, everything. It feels like someone's actually trying to squash me like that. So it's just like I get really bad pain in my face, in my neck, in my back. Which is why I've got the pillows behind me now. Because my back is killing me. And the bad anxiety is starting to really hit me. And it feels basically like... I have no way of controlling it. My body is entering shutdown because I've had so much sensory information to process that I've had to keep focus. I've had to keep on topic, on task, and I've been unable to relax. I've been constantly on the go all day, and it's getting to the point where now my meltdowns are basically a way of where people get too next to me or too near me, or I hear a lot of voices around me. It just helps me it doesn't help me to shut down it makes me feel really anxious and um, basically I don't know how to explain it It becomes sort of a mixture of pain emotional pain so my emotions are affected physical pain such as the back pain the anxiety the self-doubt the negativity feeling isolated lonely feeling like I can't breathe and it just basically reaffects me to a point where I'm able I'm unable to control anything whatsoever and I get to a point where I feel like no one wants to know about it and they don't really understand how much pain I'm in right now. I'm in a lot of pain to the point where I'm overloaded, my social tank is running on empty. And yeah, so I want to kind of share with you some pain that I go through. I'm having to go through constant anxiety, constant stress. My mind is constantly going in and out of thoughts all the time. And I'm having to constantly try and calm my speech down and constantly reassure myself that I'm safe, that I'm fine. And it's really, really hard to do that when you're in a meltdown situation, when you feel anxious like this. And it becomes to the fact that my brain is just overloaded, constant, and I'm unable to slow down, I'm unable to process, I'm unable to feel or accept why these feelings are happening to me. And it gets to the point where I just feel like everything is lost and yeah so i just want to share a brief encounter about a meltdown with you please like comment share and subscribe for more guys bye